So uh, welcome to the first of our Derby Diary pieces, uh, something that we continue, or we aim to continue to do throughout the Derby, uh, to begin with possibly once or twice a week, and then as we get closer, maybe even on a daily basis. Joined today by Nathan Corden at Toaster. And Nathan, the first thing we need to talk about, I think, given the previous publicity, is the new starting traps. How's everything gone? I think um, we're, we're really, really pleased with them, to be honest. Um, you, you can see from the heats of the um, KAB Maiden Derby, you know, obviously Traps 5, Traps 6, you know, they won, they broke. So um, I think they work really, really well. Obviously, when we're, when we're looking at, at kind of biases, you, inevitably, I think, and you had the same thing at Nottingham, the fact that you're only yeah. going to get a small number of wide run, genuine wide runners means that that. So so the traps are you. We're, we're satisfied now that the traps issue has gone away. Um, yeah, that, that, sorry that that will um, so therein uh, over the next couple of weeks we'll be replacing the sprint traps with with an, a satellite that and also we'll be installing a new shorter four bend distance which will also double up as a shorter eight bend distance as well. Okay, and do we know what that is going to be yet? Not yet. It's it's going to be around four six five meters um for the short set of four band distance um but obviously we, we've just got to that's in our opinion we've just got to tweak things and, and make sure it is that and um get it officially measured and registered with the gbgb um now you sent out uh, a notification yesterday regarding trials just just remind me what that said yeah, so uh, obviously coming to this time of year with the Derby, uh, we are getting inundated with trial requests. So um, we have a, a, the official Derby trial day is a Monday. Um, so we've got quite a few booked in for this coming Monday. Anybody wanting to book in for Monday, they really do need to book by 12 noon on the Thursday before. Um, then we have some, um, you know, a limited amount of pre-racing trials on Sunday uh, afternoon and then Tuesday evening, plus a limited amount of post-racing trials on Thursday and also Sunday. Oh, so there is quite a lot of, of, of uh, what would we call it, margin. There's, there's, a, there's quite a lot of options in there for people. Yeah, th th there's a lot of opportunity. But, um, but you know, I, I, I just think, you know, we did this a couple of years ago. We, we just want to keep putting that message out so people... Don't leave it to the last minute and think, oh, I can't get a trial that day because it's full now. You know, there's no harm in booking in two or three weeks in advance. Um, and to be fair, you know, a lot of the Irish have been doing that. We've, we've got plenty of trials held for, you know, 22nd of May and, you know, beyond there. So, so the Irish are coming in force again, that's for sure. Yeah, I wanted to ask you about that. Who do we know is coming and how do we know in what kind of numbers? Mm -hmm. So obviously we, we, we know so far um, Paul Hennessy is coming over. He, he's got runners in the, uh, with JT Wexford, he's trialled. He'll have probably runners in the um, Derby trial stakes next week. He, he trialled Beach Avenue, it'll probably be Priceless Jet and JT Havana as well. Uh, Graham Holland trialled last weekend with four dogs. Uh, new in session, native maestro to the name couple. Uh, this Sunday we've got um, Oliver Shields, he's bringing in Augsair. And then um, we've also got um, Larry Dunn, who's bringing Knight's Tornado. They're, they're both trialling on Sunday. Um, obviously, Robert Gleeson, he, he's got runners again in the in the Maiden Derby. Plus, uh, he trialled Toolmaker Sydney the other day. Um, who else have we got? Uh, Liam Downing. Dowling's getting booked in. He said he could have up to about nine runners. Uh, Carol Ramsbottom's got uh, some trials booked, so so there's still a few more that we need to to, to get, including like um, Pat Buckley. Hopefully, um, Damien Matthews will be coming over with the machine who got to the puppy English puppy derby at Toaster in December. So you know, I, I think there'll be a good contingency. So if you took anybody's gets hold of Pat Buckley, tell him to book his trials. Yeah, <laughs> I, I've already left him a few messages. <laughs> Brilliant stuff. Nathan, I think that rounds it up nicely. Hopefully we'll speak again shortly. Thanks, Floyd. Cheers.